Hi everyone, I'm LT Snake Plissken. Welcome to another Elk Finance video. So today I want to talk about the Moose NFTs, how we verify their legitimacy on NFT marketplaces, specifically on AVAX and Polygon. So if you're looking uh, for information on that, please stick around. I'm going to go over how to do that, uh, touch on how to put your moose up for sale as well. Um, we've had some incidents of people getting scammed uh, because people are putting up fake moose NFTs, which is, you know, very not cool. So I wanted to guide you through uh, to make sure that doesn't happen. Um, keep in mind, this is only AVAX and Polygon. If you're looking uh, to transfer a phantom moose and sell a phantom moose on an NFT marketplace, there is yet to be an NFT marketplace that will sell the moose at the time of filming. So if you're comfortable, uh, you can contact me specifically in the Telegram chat uh, linked below for, uh, the, of course, the official Elk Finance chat. Um, and I can kind of be a go-between. If you just want to transfer your moose to somebody else, I've got another video on that, and you can also check that in the link below. All right, so before we get started, I want to mention that I'm not a financial advisor, and this is not financial advice. If you're just looking for the Polygon Moose tutorial, please skip about five minutes ahead uh, from right now, and you should just be able to see that part. The processes are pretty similar. All right, let's get started on how to verify a legitimate moose on the Snowflake Marketplace, and that's on Avalanche. So that is on snowflake.market. The link will be below. So we're going to head there. Make sure our wallet is connected. If it isn't, it's going to prompt us to connect to the C chain, the AVAX C chain, which we will do and approve in our MetaMask. So once that's all done, uh, we're going to click on Marketplace. And it's going to show us everything uh, by newest that's for sale. Now. Unfortunately, there is no search function here, so you're going to have to find it manually. So I'm going to scroll down and go to page two here. I know there's, uh, I saw a moose here. There we go. So that'll pop up there, and we're going to uh, click details. Now, the best way right off the bat to tell if this is legitimate or not is to look at the contract address in the link. That's the, after the slash after token, uh, you're going to see an OX1FA a contract address. If you don't see that address, it's a scam, it's a fake, someone's trying to fool you and get your money. Uh, and that's uh, the contract address, that's the correct one there on AVAX. The contract address is going to be different if you're buying a Polygon Moose or a Phantom Moose, etc. Um, though this this is the legitimate one here, and, and it's followed by two colons and the number. So we could actually put in any Moose number here and it would tell us who owns it. Now, the owner address here is simply the Snowflake Marketplace address. Uh, so we know they, they own it. Um, so any, market, uh, any NFT up for sale on this marketplace is going to be owned by this address. And we can see who it was listed by, this OX642F. Now, if we're going to spend up to 225 AVAX, uh, we want to verify it's legitimate. Of course, we can make an offer that they could accept that's, that's lower than that. Uh, but it really depends, um, you know, how much they go for and, and what they'll accept and depending on the buyer and how they value that. Uh, so to check some extra steps is what we're going to do is grab this contract address here and we're going to head over to cchain.explorer.avax.network. Again, it'll be linked below and we're going to punch that in here to the search bar to the right and hit enter. Uh, and that'll take us to the contract address for Moose. And uh, you can click the descriptor here, the Moose V1. Uh, it's right under the contract address. And this will just bring up a different um, page with some token transfers on it. So we can actually see right here that this OX642F address transferred it to our Snowflake Marketplace address, that OXD42 one. Um, so that's a really good sign. Of course, that's what we'd expect. Uh, if it, if they listed a while ago, as in more than four hours ago, we might have to scroll a bit to find that transfer. But you could kind of use Control F to search for uh, the first few uh, symbols, letters of the address uh, to kind of find it in these transfers. Uh, could be on any any of these pages, depending on how long ago it was listed. So that's good news. The next thing, if we want to triple check that it's legitimate, we can go to read contract. 
uh, and, and we're going to scroll all the way down to number 18 in, in the contract. And this is where we can query the owner uh, of the of the token. And what we, of course, expect is that it's the Snowflake, Snowflake Marketplace. So it's moose number 13. So we're just going to type 13 in there. Of course, substitute it with the number that you're checking. You can hit query. And of course, it gives us this Snowflake address as expected. So with this one, all of these line up. Uh, and it appears to be an authentic moose. Now, what if you wanted to list uh, one of your NFTs, your uh, moose or something else? Well, you head on over here to where your address is and hit my wallet. And if I did have some NFTs here, I could go ahead and uh, click on the details of it and click list. And I would be able to list it for whatever price I felt like in AVAX. Um, so, of course, if you're willing and wanting to list your moose, you can go ahead and do that this way. Um, all right. Well, I hope that was helpful on uh, AVAX. Uh, and, and this is just with the Snowflake Marketplace. Of course, there might be some other NFT marketplaces added in the future. But for now, this is, uh, this is what we got. Um, so stay tuned if you want to hear more about how to verify this same information on Polygon. Okay, so let's look at the Polygon Moose and how to verify that one up for sale is legitimate. So we're gonna head on over to OpenSea.io. Again, the link will be in the description. So this is the same NFT marketplace that uh, is also on Ethereum, but thankfully it's also on, on Polygon. Uh, so finding a Moose NFT on here is a bit of a process. I'm, I'm gonna walk you through that. So what we're going to do here is we're just going to type moose into the search bar. It's going to bring up a whole bunch of stuff, but thankfully we've got a filter. So we want to filter a few things. We want something that's actually for sale. Uh, if we don't search something for sale, we can, we can make an offer on any NFT, but if they're not on OpenSea and they're not thinking about selling it, they may never see your offer. Um, and when you're offering, you actually want to have some wrapped ether in your MetaMask, in your Polygon uh, wallet, whether it be MetaMask, I guess, or, or whatever uh, wallet you use. Uh, so you'll see all the prices are in Ethereum. All right, so back to filters. So we're going to put the buy now filter on, uh, making sure it's for sale. And we're going to scroll on down here to chains and click Polygon. Now, at the time of writing, there's not a whole lot of moose related NFTs on Polygon. So you may need to apply other filters to simply get uh, our moose. I really wish you could search by contract address, but unfortunately uh, you can't. So let's click on here, moose, uh, Matic Moose 58 here, which is an epic. And uh, listed for a whopping $19,604. That is, that is a lot of ETH. That's a lot. Okay, so let's let's uh, verify if this this listing is legitimate. So the first thing we're going to check again, just like the AVAX moves, is the contract address in the search bar. So it's this OXD5 uh, EF28. Yeah, that is the correct contract address for the Matic or Polygon moves. The number one thing you're going to notice here is that uh, a bunch of these moose look like the AVAX one. They're, they're a different color. Do not buy these. They're, they're not, if you see them up for sale, it's a scam. Uh, these, you can tell right off the bat, are non-transferable. So what would happen is you would pay uh, in your ether and you would actually never receive the NFT because they're non-transferable. What happened uh, was an error with the first issue of the moose on Polygon and uh, they had to reissue them with a second contract address. Unfortunately, that left uh, these uh, AVAX looking moose in people's wallets and some people unfortunately have decided to be fraudulent and terrible human beings and list them on the marketplace even though they're not for sale and they're clear fakes. So if you see this, get out of there right away. Now, uh, let's head back to our Moose 58 for a grand total of $19,604. At time of filming, you know, I wouldn't I wouldn't recommend paying that much money. Depends, you know, how much you, you want one of these. 
Um, though, so if you find one that's listed for ETH for a more reasonable price, you can you can verify this in the contract address here, uh, which again is linked below. So we're going to copy that. We're going to head on over to PolygonScan.com into the Moose contract. I'll link that directly for both chains. Uh, and we're going to open that, uh, click on our token tracker, hit read contract. And again, we're going to go down to number 18. And we're going to put the number of the moose that we're looking at, in which case this is 58. We're going to query it. And we see the owner is OXFE5539. Uh, FE5539. That lines up. So although expensive, this is a legitimate moose, an epic moose. Uh, and so this is indeed the owner of 58 and the contract address lines up. So you should be uh, safe to go ahead and, and buy this one if you'd like. Now, if you want to list your moose, you can head into your wallet here and, uh, and simply set it up in a collection and list it for whatever price you want. All right. Well, I hope that was helpful for everyone. So please like and subscribe if that, uh, you know, you felt this was, was helpful. Please reach out to me directly if you have any questions. I can be found in the Elk Telegram uh, and Discord. Uh, the links are below at LT Snake Pliskin. Uh, yeah, so we appreciate you guys and uh, be safe out there.